All right, here's the deal, everyone. I'm in Chicago, the Windy City. This is my room. Pretty, it's really small. I just kind of picked one. It was like the most stress I've ever had parking. I'm on my way to Calgary. I'm moving there. So I stopped in Chicago for Thursday and I'm here all day Friday. Tomorrow, we're going to try a bunch of deep dishes and find the best deep dish pizza. But tonight, I'm just going to Portillo's for a hot dog. Hi, how's it going? I'm good. Can I just grab the Portillo's beef hot dog? Uh, no, that's it for now. Just on credit. Okay, this is the dog. I took a bite out of it because I made a TikTok already. Cool place, kind of like an arcade inside. Voted number one fastest casual restaurant in the nation. Don't know who gave him that. It also took like 15 minutes. The dog's all right. The dog actually isn't good, but the stuff that's around the dog is good. The bun's nice. The pickle, celery, relish, all super good. It's just the dog's like a step up from boiled hot dogs. So I'm probably gonna find somewhere else to eat because I didn't realize it was gonna be so small. But yeah, Portillo's hot dogs. I'm glad we got that out of the way first. I went back to Partillo's. I got a chocolate cake shake, apparently a staple. It's hectic in there. I would have done this in there, but it's like probably the most hectic place I've ever been. I think I have video there. Quick sip. Kind of, I think it's exactly what it sounds like. It's a chocolate cake shake. They just sort of blend it up. I also got small fries with their cheese sauce. Cheese sauce. This took 40 minutes, so. Fat, number one fast casual restaurant. That's what it's called. Cheese sauce is still hot. Let's see if I can get a cheese pull for this, eh? Hey? Cheese pull? Oh, it looks like it's made out of Kraft Singles. Oh no. Those are not good fries. I think I either like hate it the most I've ever hated a food or like I like it really a lot. I've also been up driving since 5 a.m. So it could have to do with that. Yeah, they're not good. Anyway, tomorrow's going to be fun. Find the best deep dish. Go to the bean. Good night. Peace out. Tomorrow's going to be fun. All right, guys, it's a new day. We're still in Chicago. I'm trying a bunch of food spots today. I said I was going to try a bunch of deep dish, but apparently it's just turning into a Chicago food tour. We got a camera person today. Upgrades. We came to Devil Dogs, so I already took a bite because TikTok eats first, but I didn't even, that was the messiest bite I've ever seen. The onion's a little better than Portillo's, honestly, but I'm not a huge fan of whatever dogs they're using. I think people are telling me it's like the classic Chicago dog, but it feels like when your white mom just boils hot dogs, so. I'm not a fan of it. Devil dogs. On to the next one. I'm good. Uh, I just want to grab a small deep dish. Just a classic, like cheese and sauce. I just came here to find you. That ass. <laughs> What's up, man? Ty Bridgewater. What's up, man? How are you? Man, how are you? Oh, sorry. I just heard music. <laughs> yeah, small deep dish. Just like cheese and sauce. Parmesan on top. Butter crust? Yeah, do it, you know? Why not cut, cut it up? Three o'clock? Okay, perfect, thank you. Thanks, man, have a good one. Bye, love it. All right, we went to Lou, I can't even say it, Lou Manolettis, Manolini. I've been saying every single name possible. Just a small deep dish. They hit me up on Instagram, they actually paid for it, so comped meal, but it's kind of more like a shallow. I didn't show you guys, but I had this crazy steak dinner too that I got invited to. I'll pop something up about it. TikTok ate first, but. My problem is just that the cheese feels so clumpy. The guy made me get a butter crust when I called, like he wouldn't let me hang up unless I got a butter crust. It was kind of insane. The sauce, 
it's just like it feels like a jarred sauce i don't know what to say about it lou marinelli's i'm gonna go try Giodornos or however you say it it's like the other chicago place and then i'm gonna go to the bean so fun day of eating for everyone see you there all right guys we went and got Giodornos. i think it's way better than lou's it's actually deep it doesn't look like they just were barely trying Lou, Lou's kind of feels like Chicago light, like deep dish light. Like maybe it's your first time experience deep dish and you want to like, you hit up Lou's, but Gio Dorno says, we don't care if you've been here before or not. You're a local at our place, which is kind of like family. We're at the Bean. I figured I'd come see it because I'm like a tourist pretty much. You know, you can see the skyline from the Bean. It's fun. So Chicago's a fun city. I love Chicago. Give you a bite just to see it. The string's kind of gone, but when you freshly get it, it's got a good string, I promise. I would make the joke at the bean, but I'm not 12. Anyway, love Chicago, love deep dish. Have a good one. All right, I had to come in the car to do this. Look at this. I went to Gene and Jude's, last place I'm hitting in Chicago. It looks like all fries, but there's actually a hot dog under there. YouTube exclusive, I'm not I'm not doing a TikTok on this. You see it? It's a dog, there's a bunch of fries in it. It's pretty insane. Dog looks a little light. Quick bite, keep it healthy. Tastes like the rest of the hot dogs, but just with piping hot french fries on it. That's insane. But that's it, I'm kind of like outside of Chicago now. I'm on my way to Minneapolis. Chicago is great though, and this, I hope is a cool video. I tried a bunch of spots. I walked 22,000 steps yesterday. If you like it, like and subscribe. You guys are the best. Peace out.